let me show you how we can move data from the USB device or to USB device on the Motorola Edge 60 Pro. So if you have USB storage, once you connect it, what you need to do is open a file manager, uh, which allows you to view files. For example, we have the files app by Google. You should be able to find it in the app drawer, for example, by going to the Google folder over here. Now, once we are here at the bottom, you should be able to find the internal storage and our USB flash drive. So if you want to transfer files from the phone, from the internal storage to the flash drive, then first we need to go to the internal storage, find the file that we wish to move. So let's say I'm going to go to DCIM. Well, there's not actually nothing here. So let me try to find anything really that we can transfer. Okay, so I just quickly transferred something. I have it over here. So if you want to transfer something from the internal storage to the flash drive, we can tap, for example, on these three dots over here on the right side and to choose move to. You can also press and hold our finger on the first file and then select everything that we wish to transfer. So we can select multiple items at once, multiple files, tap on these three dots in the top right corner. And over here, we also have move to. So since we transfer from the internal storage to the flash drive, we want to select move to flash drive to the USB device. And over here now we need to choose where we wanted to transfer it. So for example, I'm gonna choose this DCIM folder as well. And then we can choose move here. And there we go. Now we can go back, we can exit the internal storage. Let's go to the USB storage. And over here, if I go to DCIM, of course I can find my photo over here. Now, if you want to transfer the other way around, then it is pretty similar. The difference is that we start with the USB storage and then we need to find whatever we want to transfer once again, tap on these three dots or select everything that you wish to transfer and then choose move to. This time, of course, we want to choose internal storage and decide where it should be moved. So that's all. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.